morning and welcome back to the channel. Um, we've been plagued by high winds and storms this week in Cumbria and uh, this could be a short uh, video today. Um, so I apologise for the wind now. Um, I got asked last week um, about the advanced settings that I showed you in my last video and uh, a lot of people wanted to hear the tones. I'm going to try to do my best today, but it may not be possible and we may have to wait till we have uh, a bit better weather. Okay, let's uh, get out there and see what we can find. So I'm going to be searching around these old buildings today, and walls, to try and keep out the wind. Got Hazel down there, she's at it already. Right, okay. Let's see what we can get. So first up, came over at 20. That's an Edward. Penny. Not very deep that. It's right by the wall. And these trees there. Okay, let's move on. So, I've just had an 18 and uh, dug the turf off. Uh, I'm gonna uh, see if I can show you what it sounds like. Just turn my headphones off. Better in mind, I'm only using a mobile phone to do my filming on. I'm not into these modern uh, gadgets or anything. So we've got that set to a, a high tone, not quite as high as the lower numbers. But it's uh, quite a good tone. So 18, you're going to get, you could get gold at 18. Gold coins come at 18. Copper coins, some copper coins coming at 18. Let's see what we have. Oh, it's another buckle. Another complete buckle, look. Oh, nearly complete. Bit, the bit there's broke off. Okay, let's move on to the next. Right, so I've got another signal here. It's 25. Uh, possibly a copper coin. Or even, could, could be a milled silver coin. I'll just turn the headphones off. So I've got this set to, I've got the higher numbers set to a low, I've set to a low tone. So anybody who's just watching now, last week's video, I adjusted the advanced settings on five tones. So I had um, a very high tone coming in at low numbers where, where the hammer's coming at and and where the copper coin's coming at and uh, your bigger silver coins. I had that set to a low tone. So this is the 25, this is set to a low tone. Right, let's dig it out, see what it is. Nothing spectacular. It's part of an old door, door lock. Okay, so just for an example, we have a seven, eight, all right, six and seven, and I've got them as low numbers, they're low numbers, and I've got them set to a high tone. Bop, 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 bop. 
Oh, it's very high pitched tone. So let's dig it, find out where uh, what it might be. So here we have it, that was a six and a seven. Just goes to show to dig them low numbers. That is why I've got it set to a high tone. Not too sure what that is. It's a coin, possibly a farthing. Let's see if we can clean it up. Get some picks up. So again. We have a 15, also set to a high tone, because that's where, that's where your yeah, uh, hammered coming at as well, your yeah, Eddie Penny's type size hammered. <coughs> right, let's give that a dig. Very hard for me to show you me digging because I've had to use my two hands to use up my phone. That's another buckle. as well that'll uh looks uh georgian in date late seventeen hundreds this is the beauty about pasture that's never been ploughed I've got these uh, tones set up was only really to show you um, how to set the advanced settings this week. It's personal preference, you can adjust them to wherever you want to adjust them to. But I like the low numbers at high tones to be uh, the, the armored sort of ID numbers. Um, might be too windy and empty for you to hear these tones. I won't know till I get, get home and find out. We can uh, get some finds together after and put them over the coil uh, so you can hear them properly. It really doesn't matter whether you're in two tone, five tone, fifty tones. You're still going to pick up. You're still going to pick up the signals. It's really per personal preference. But the more tones that you do use. Uh, you'll get more information on what the ground's telling you. Okay, let's carry on. Right, so next up we have what looks like a cartwheel penny. Uh, good depth, about 10 inches. Big chunk of coin. And I got that set to that came over at 30. Set that set to uh, auto. I'm gonna let you see what that sounds like now. Coin. Let's f try and find that little tiny coin that I found earlier. It came over at 607. 
it's actually I can actually see more detail on that now it's you can zoom in and it's actually got a hole at the top of there so somebody must have had it on a chain or right so we'll put that there so this is the tone you're getting for the low numbers That's all you're getting for the eye numbers. Still coming in at it's still coming in at six and seven out of the ground. That's explained it. I hope you can hear it for this wind. Uh, we're due to get uh, a bit of heavy rain this afternoon, so I may have to stop filming and I may have to. I'm going to carry on detecting though, and I'll catch you all maybe at home. And uh, if anything good comes up, I'll show you. Okay, for now. So I've just had a 27. I think that could be a ring. detail on it when we get home. Okay, let's carry on. So we're back at the car, we've had to give up, absolutely wet through and the wind, I'm just having a egg bun, that might start a bit of debate whether you call them a bun or a bap or whatever you want to call them, depending what part of the world you're from. Uh, so today is Mother's Day and it's probably the only advantage of uh, detecting with your like, wife because you can go out on Mother's Day. Probably the only advantage of going out with your wife. <laughs> right, okay, we'll catch you at home for a roundup. Right, so we're back home. Horrendous weather today, horrendous. We did manage to get a bit of digging done. Nothing special, but um, it's all about just getting out there, isn't it? Um, so me me aim today was to show people who wanted to know what the tones uh, sounded like after I'd set it up last week in the advanced settings. Um, so it was very windy today and I, I haven't checked the videos yet to see if you can actually hear the sound or not. So we will throw some things over the target. We will look, have a look what we've found today. The most unusual thing I've found, and I don't know what it is, it's tiny, it looks like an odd shaped tiny little spoon, but it's not silver, it's made of pewter. If anybody knows what that is, comment below, please. And also what we had, so we've got a, a ring, a poo man's ring, and then we've got George III, Cartwheel Penny, Small buckle, another buckle, some sort of wheel, um, another George the Third coin, Victoria, Edward. Not sure what that one is. Spoon handle and the usual, the usual rubbish. Uh, buttons, a lot of bullets. Um, I've got a. A George the a George the third coin there, which would have been in really good condition when it was dropped in seventeen eighty six. You can see the the, the uh, it's had it in the ground, doesn't it? 
but that that would have been that would have been a mint coin when it was dropped you can still see the edges on it this is the small coin and i it looks like a foreign coin i could just make out some sort of like eagle on it you can see better there and that came over at six or six and seven so that could have easily been something good maybe that maybe that could be a german coin don't know oh what else did we get we got a St. John's Ambulance Badge. A couple of musket balls. Right, that's it. So, so that's it basically for today. So while we're in while we're in the shed, I'm going to, just going to show you the difference between how I set them them tones up last week to a high tone for your smaller targets and your hammered coins, and then a lower tone for your higher targets like your big pennies and your. Um, your normal pennies or your milled silver so over here i've got a i've got a a worn out hammered coin which has probably been an eddie penny and uh what we're going to do now is we're going to have a look at the id numbers and i'm going to wave it over the call and you can you can hear what the high tone is that i've set it up to So that's what I'm looking for when I'm uh, when I'm out, and then here's your your higher. And so I've got a low tone for your milled stuff, your milled silver, and your bigger coins. Uh, we'll get a, a small another small target. Here's that coin that came up at six and seven. And then there's the ring. I think the ring came over about 18, I think, was it? No, or was it um, 20, no, 24, so another low tone. Right, so, um, that's probably it for today and uh, I hope, I'm hoping to get out next weekend to test the Coiltec coils, the 15 inch Coiltec coil out with uh, grain from unearthed. Okay, thank you for watching, see you all again.